any one senator can require the entire Senate to cast 60 votes to stop a filibuster and move to what we call an up or down vote, a simple majority vote on a nominee. So any one senator could make us get 60 votes. That has happened before. We had to get 60 votes for Justice Alito about 10 years ago. If we have to get 60 votes, I'm confident we will. You just asserted basically that if Democrats attempt a filibuster, you will change the rules and use the nuclear option, correct? No, I, no, I haven't said what, what will happen at that point. I'm confident that we'll get 60 votes. Uh, look, this justice, uh, this nominee ought to be treated just like uh, President Clinton and President Obama were treated. In the first uh, term of President Clinton, two Supreme Court uh, nominees, no filibuster, no filibuster. We were in the minority like they are right now. President Obama, in his first term, two Supreme Court nominees, my party was in the minority, no filibuster. What we're arguing here for is equivalency. They're having a very, very difficult time, Jake, trying to come up with arguments against uh, Judge Gorsuch. This is an outstanding uh, uh, nomination. You could argue the most outstanding judge in the current appellate court system. So they're really struggling to try to figure out some basis upon which to oppose them.